Let me ask you an open-end question. What is the propulsion force that moves your car forward? What is the propulsion force that moves your car forward? Discuss this with your groups for 30 seconds and come up with some sort of force to fill in the blank. Did we come up with any good ideas in here? Push your mic button on. Let's let people at home hear us chat about it. Anybody come up with a good uh, answer? And what about table three back there? What did you guys come up with? The force should be greater than the static friction. Okay. The force should be greater than the static friction. Is that what you said? Yeah. Okay. What about table one right here? What do you guys think? Chemical reaction. Chemical reaction. Okay. So something happening in the engine maybe. Okay. What about you guys over here? Uh, we thought it might be torque. Torque. All right. We haven't really learned about torque yet, but we will in an upcoming chapter. Torque is a lot of fun, right? That's one of the things that people tell you about their car. What's the torque? What about table four over here? Combustion. What's that? Combustion. Combustion in the engine. And what about the last table? Engine. The engine. Okay, we all know how the engine works, right? How does the engine work? You put a gas air mixture into a cylinder, the spark plug ignites it, it creates this little mini explosion. It pushes on a piston, which connects to the crankshaft, which connects to the transmission, which drives your wheels, right? So there's these mini, mini explosions happening in your car all the time. If you have an internal combustion engine, if you have an electric vehicle, then it's totally different, okay? What is the ultimate propulsion force that moves your car forward? I don't think I heard it from anybody. It is static friction. Static friction is ultimately what moves your car forward. Did, we, did you guys say it back there? You guys talked about static friction. It was in there somewhere. I know you said a whole bunch of things and static friction was a couple of them. So we'll give you a half point. Static friction. If there's no friction between the rubber and the road, you can't move your car forward. It doesn't matter what that engine is doing, you can't get the car moving. So static friction is the ultimate propulsion force that is moving your car forward. It's also the ultimate braking force. What is stopping your car ultimately? Static friction between the rubber and the road. This is if your wheels are still rolling, okay? As we talked about last time, if they slide, then it's kinetic friction. But static friction for normal driving is what is driving your car forward and is what ultimately is stopping your car. All right. I think that's enough for today. Why don't we get out of here? Have a fantastic day. Yes. I will see you guys on uh, Wednesday. Cheers. <laughs> <laughs>